You're looking at the earthquakes plotted in the world from the past 30 days, 7 days, 24 hours, and past hour. Now you're looking at earthquake energy distribution by magnitude. This is worldwide, and you're seeing them changing as they did every 10 minutes within the last hour. Different colored columns are for 30 days, 7 days, 24 hours, and the last hour. Now you're seeing the next magnitude ratios, which is a graph of the ratio of, say, magnitude 2 to the number of magnitude 3s, which should stay consistent for any given area. If it changes between the last 30 days, 7 days, 24 hours, and last hour, it may indicate something unusual happening in that area. This is worldwide. And now you're seeing the same thing for just the subset area in California. Again, the black column is 30 days, blue is 7, green is 24 hours, and gold is in the last hour. Any ratios out of whack will show up as a red column and may indicate a new earthquake might occur at the higher next magnitude. Well, that's the earthquake report. Please like, share, and subscribe. It really helps us. And consider supporting our Patreon at patreon.com slash geopilot as linked in the description. We appreciate you watching, and thank you very much.